you to talk to our makeup lady, see if you can hide this double G. Did it work? Yeah, beard has it. Volunteered to be Jeremy's decoy. We think an inferior deer might make him frisky. Howdy folks, we're on the road for a change finally. I'm gonna head down and do a little axis hunting this weekend. Got my chauffeur Jeremy over there taking care of keeping us safe down the road. This is both of our first ever spot and stock type of hunting. Uh, neither one of us have ever hunted Axis either. So this might be a very interesting trip. Um, I think the plan is, is that we're just gonna swap spot and stocks. Is that what we're gonna do? So we'll do a little arrow shooting contest to kind of draw straws to see who gets to go spook the deer first. And then we'll just kind of leapfrog from there, I guess. Um, definitely gonna be kind of neat. I'm excited. Jeremy, what are your expectations for the, the trip? I just want to bring some meat home. Yeah. I don't care who shoots it. We'll split it. It don't matter. I just want to be successful and bring some meat uh, home. No guarantee on anything. Uh, it is bow only. So uh, that's the way we prefer to hunt anyway. But from what we're being told is that the axis are bas basically like on crack. I mean, they're just going to be really, really wiry. Um, get hunted all the time and spook real easy. Yeah, they spook real easy. So this will definitely be a new adventure, new challenge for us. Warfield's back. What's all these things growing out of the ground? I think they call them trees. A tree? on this place? Straight across it. It's not showing one. Are they going to go through that dang hop fence? Eating up there. There's three of them. Yeah. That one's got some horns. Two of them do for sure. Oh, okay. I see them. 
the other side by side. Three of them, yeah, there's three bucks. It's gonna look like crap on the camera. That one's just looking at us like, what? I never saw that other doe come out. God, I mean, those are some big bugs. Uh, I mean, they look like it anyway. Back out of the brush there. Did they? Yeah, they're hugging the left side. I can see them on the camera. All right, that buck's walking back out. They're almost up at the... We just thank you for this wonderful weekend and this week that we get to spend with all these godly men. Lord, we just ask that you watch over each and every one of us and keep us safe. And Lord, we pray for a quick harvest for all the animals that you are about to bless us with. Just walk with us today and just use us, even though we're just out here, you know, on our own doing a hunt. We're still about your work. So, Lord, give us the words of encouragement to speak to the other men and just any other influence that we can do today. In your name, we pray. Amen. Mm. Rock on, guys. Good luck. Good. All right, show me your fancy release. Tell me about it. What? That's an axe bull over here in Kent. Looks like it's a young bull. Yeah, this is our rangefinder sling. It's called the free range sling. It moves up and down freely. Shot cord. Take home with it. It's always out of your way. Range, drop, shoot. Pretty simple system. It's perfect for a spot in stock. So if you guys need one, I know where to get them. Where can we get them? Yeah, freerangeoutdoors.com is my website, or you can find me on social media on Instagram and Facebook uh, under the same names. And uh, just send me a direct message or uh, call some of these guys here with Elite Hunter and let them know. Uh, they can get in touch with me and we'll get you guys a product. Sweet. Stock number one, no good. These things are spooky. They were probably 100, 100 yards down. We were going slow, and next thing we knew, they were booking it. Yes, they're white too. Well, we're still at it. It pretty much died off about one o'clock or so. We've hiked at least 
probably five or six miles today. Uh, just haven't seen any any axis. We've seen quite a bit of black buck, white tail, but no axis. So Kelly and I decided that we're going to change up our tactic this evening. Not sure you can see it very well, but we are now sitting over a water hole. I just trying to change our luck. Kelly's about 100 yards on the other side of the hole. Spread out, maybe we can be successful. So fingers crossed, uh, big axis will come in and Kelly or I one will get a shot. This is morning number trace, isn't it? Morning number three, I believe. And so far, we're getting our axis kicked. And yes, I spelled that A-X-I-S for you sinners out there. And oh, look at this. we're gonna change the game plan today. We gotta paint up, do oh. something. It's cause yesterday he took a dump and he cut his. Yeah. I still got it. <laughs> It'll still fit. It'll still fit. It's just a little short. You have to paint your whole neck yeah. up. But we're going to try war paint this morning. Got to make it serious. Let's go with a little X for axis. Our hunting time is over at the Baker 3 Ranch. Uh, we're going home with zero. Nada nada. The axis kicked our axis. So, oh well. You'll have to wait for next year and we'll put a couple axis down, spot and stop. It was different, but it was fun. Definitely a big learning lesson. Yeah, we had a blast put several miles on our on our boots so ready to go elk hunting now <laughs>